Hey everybody, the Bong is back. Welcome to part two of Let's Play Conquer's Bad Fur Day. If you were there from the previous episode, I uh, messed up trying to get all the bees to the sunflower, so we're gonna do all that again. Isn't that fun or what? I wager points on the what part. Well, at least you can corral like several at a time. So you don't have to like do them individually. Also, I had to like look this up in a YouTube video to figure out like how I was supposed to get up to the other bees. It turns out the path I took was wrong. Wow, somehow that was fall damage. Cool. I'm gonna bring these over. There's chocolate on the way at least. Actually, they follow you from pretty far. So that's not, not too bad. Alright, let's skip that because we already seen that dialogue before. Just remember you press the L button to do that. So, remember we gotta go up here. There's like one stack of bees over here. Over this way. And to get to the other one... Believe it or not, there was a spot over here you could jump. And there's the ladder. Oh, you have to climb from the other side for some reason. Now we should be able to get there. Look how high up we are now. Take your time with this. It's a long way down. Uh-oh. Oh, I get up now! They didn't all scatter, did they? Did they come back? Did they all disappear? All of them? Oh, they... Okay, they just go back to where they were. Oh my god, well, at least the two of them are right close. And I was near the ladder, too. Speaking of which... I hope I can climb down without free-falling. Almost ate it from there. Time. Still take fall damage. Even if you slow your descent, it makes no difference. I think there's only like four bees, right? Is there only four? Bees that I miss. Hopefully they weren't up super high. Wait, I think I know where. I've been there before. Should be around that way, I think.
Wait, no it isn't. Why did I think it was that way? What bees were not brought over then? There! Right by the entrance. That's a great noise. Alright. Time for the fan service. like a 3 double d platformer if you ask me hey, over here. <laughs> oh. this is a pain in the ass because what you have to do is that you have to time a just right and the better you are at it oh oh, oh that was perfect oh i made it i got the money It's a European game, all right, I'm sure. All right, you. I'm gonna need your help. Right, you stay there. Oh. And I'm getting in. Say, Ow. Well, you could balance yourself on those, like, uh, pipes, and then just deal with the bats that way. Or you could just do some platforming. Uh, I'm not gonna like it with this camera. Actually, we might be fine. Oh, almost overshot it. Hmm. I know the bats are out of the way, but. Oh, press the wrong button. I missed. Yeah, I'm gonna mess them up anyway. I have a reputation to uphold, you know. Yeah, cool. Yeah, that's your head. Yeah. yeah take I'm such a good shot, but I need to be. Now freed. You're welcome. What'd you do that for? Dump Yeah, yeah, dump <laughs> Why is it you have to repeat everything I say? I, I, I don't repeat everything. Do I? Yes, you do, actually. Oh, sorry. That's the only thing. Yeah, yeah, I do. Thank you, Mr. Squirrel. I 
was hanging up there by my pretty little neck. It was like one of them there executions you hear about. Um, yeah. Anyway, what are we gonna do about this guy over here? Well, what do you wanna do about it? I'll do anything for you. Cause you is my bestest buddy in the whole wide world. <laughs> <laughs> um, just a second. <laughs> That's how the bee and the sunflower did it, too. Did you have in mind? Well, now, just hop on the back here, and we're just gonna go for a ride. Yeah, okay, but don't get any funny ideas now. This is purely a means to an end. Well, I, I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, I have a girlfriend. Ooh, we can go for a ride. Okay, get some chocolate there if you need that. Which I do. And then we go stabby stabby. I hit the flammable part. Okay, so I gotta make sure I get him on the back. Well, make sure you get him at all. Oh no. I don't think that's fully accurate, but I appreciate the effort. Nice. Stop that. Hit the floor! The floor! doesn't hurt me though. Away from me, please. You gotta go. You can somehow jump. Oh, we have to hit the pipes from behind. Come on over. It's backing up. What was I hit that with? But I don't know if you can reach that from there. Maybe you got a jump and stab? Oh, 
No, you don't do that. Oh, damn, what are you gonna do to the button now? Wait. I thought you got hit by the sparks. Are you gonna climb the pipe? Oh, you have to jump it at the right time. Oh no. I know he's coming. Uh oh. Beast. Beast to survive. Oh, he'll go back to the same one, huh? Oh no, it's a different one. You have no arms now! Oh, I think that's the last pipe I need to hit. chance oh jump wrong see ya Showed him that time. Um, hey, Frankie! Frankie! Where'd he gone? Oh no. Uh, uh, Mr. Screw, I take every dollar. You don't look too dead. Um, uh, you may be alright. What do you mean, alright? Look at me! I'm broken in two! I'm just firewood from now. They'll be using me as toothpicks before you know it. No, you'll be all right. Come on. What are you going to do? Well, I got an idea. Okay, let's see. Hey, Hope Bill. Yeah, I carry duct tape with me, too. There you go. Good as new. Uh, well, it kind of feels all right. Uh, well, it ain't so bad after all. What do you think? Yeah, it looks great. <laughs> what, what do you mean? That oh, looks great. You know, thank you, Mr. Screw. I think that of all the people in the world I've ever met, you has got to be the most generous, kindest, nicest, nicest, loveliest friend. Okay, yeah, no need to get sentimental. Anyway, we gotta find a way out of here now. Yeah, you could be right. Yep. Yeah, typical. Oh, um, uh, anyway, Mr. Screw, I've, uh, I've got to go. See ya. Oh. <laughs> oh, well. Suppose I'd better start swimming. Hmm. Don't like the look of those wires. Better be quick. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you gotta be quick, all right. You go in the water around those cables, they touch, it's over. So what you gotta do, you gotta cut those wires from up there. Some of them can be pretty hard to hit though. Is electrified now. Okay, I think it calmed down. 
No, it hasn't. Where's the other one? Give me that one. Well, I'm gonna die, so... Where was the other one? Yeah, you ain't surviving if it's electric. We definitely showed him that time. Okay. Skip that. Also, don't worry too much about lives, because even if you game over, you you just sent back to here. So why do they even have a live system at all? They just had to put it in there for the sake of putting it in there. It says it's electrified. Where? Oh! Right there. I gotta aim really low. Okay, get to the next one. Before it gets worse. Oh, camera perspective. Had to change everything. Got that one too. I don't think there's any others, are there? Not from what I could see. Oh, there's the way out. I did it. Oh. Oh, where am I? I'm over here. Oh, money? Drop. Ow. be a millionaire other than a billionaire anyway where are we oh we're over here okay let's see what's up this ladder making some steady progress after what happened in the previous episode uh oh. Okay, you can get on that, but it doesn't go anywhere. So I had to dodge some wasps. <gasps> Good one. That was close. Up we are now. It doesn't even scroll up vertically for some reason. 
But, uh... Look how large this world can feel like. Oh, that wasp was kind of confusing me for a brief moment. Oh, good thing I pressed B. It's open now. I know where this is. That's a bucket that I was to before, when I was getting the bees. Okay, I hit the A button, it didn't register then. They put lots of chocolate there, because they know what they did with this game. Where did that open to? Was it over... Down there? No, it great opened. Maybe it was in the other place. Aha! Yeah, that's open now. Even more money. Oh, another wise guy. Come on in. Cool. I'm gonna have that gold card before you know it. Oh, no, oh, that takes me back. Yeah, yeah. Oh wait, I'm on the other side of this now. So, that did have an extra, extra life at least. So that's helpful. Well, actually, it doesn't matter like I said before. But I guess if you really want to see number go up. What happens if I just like, leave and re-enter? Does that life come back? I'm gonna double check, and then we can move on to new areas. Oh yeah, it does come back. So I guess if you care that much about getting a high amount of lives, if that's your thing, well, now you can. A little bit of back and forth. You can do it. So I think the other way that smells a bit pooey, that's where we want to go. Where was it to again? That way? Oh, cat. What a stink. This thing calls for a gas mask. Yeah, I have that on me too. Okay, we can go up that turd tower, or we can just go in here. You better hurry up. What are you looking at? Nothing, sire. Good. Oh, I think I can hear him. I think I have found the problem. Ah, we have here, if you look, the table. If you analyze the table closely, as I have done, most particularly, you will see that there is a gap. And we are not talking any old gap here, my lord. It is a sizable one. Now, milk goes here. 
What happens? We have the fulcrum here, the milk here. The veg problem, not good. Milk falls off because of a gap. Yeah, that is what is the problem. The gap. I think I see. And the solution. Ah, now this is where it gets complicated. I was mulling over what was fitting to I tried many things. I tried elephants, pot plants, many things. But the one thing, and I was sure of it at the time, I was sure it was a rodent. Sure enough, it was. This one. Furious Twitchtelius. To use the proper vernacular. To the layman, the red square. This red square. Yes. Squirrel. I've heard of them. Yes. So? So it's a simple malish. We need a squirrel. And we put him here. You know spill your milk? We don't get bucked Gentlemen. Yes, my liege. Get to me. There's only one red squirrel in the entire universe. Get that one. Hey, all right there. How you doing? Hi, hi, how you doing? Come on, come in now. Yeah, sit down, what do you want? Oh, this, this like really smells. Ah, uh, well, if she wear like dung beetles and you roll the poo around, knows what's for. Oh, really? If you want some, you want some poo? Um, uh, uh, all right, get your ass in there. There's these cows. Get them in there. Get them to crap, and I'll make you a ball of poo. And you can do what the hell you like with it. Go on, on your break. You still here? that. Oh, charming. Okay. What? Is that his... Is the money up there? Ah. Money over here. I can't reach it, sorry. I'm gonna have to take care of some shit. Literally. Hey, over here. Oh, oh god. Fart humor. You know fart humor, right? Is it up here we gotta go? Not exactly a, the best of views. What? Um. The uh, the poo falling actually counts as a hazard. Cool. Thanks, game. Am I supposed to go in there? I think I'm supposed to go this way. Hmm. Do I really want to eat that chocolate? In there? It may not seem like the best of plans. Oh, this part. Ah, right. Don't see any poo here. Oh, hey, uh, excuse me. Hello? Yeah, you. Uh, <clears throat> whoa. <laughs> Friendly type. I'm looking for some poo. I know it's Sounds pretty strange, but <coughs> oh. <coughs> red, red. I don't like red. <coughs> I hate red. Go away. Whoa! Take it. He doesn't like red. What? I don't see anything red around. Oh, here we go again. <coughs> Why you dealt with bulls before? Well, at least there's health nearby. Ah, oh, you missed, pal. Oh, 
fine. We missed again. Prune juice. I think I need something with that. Oh, I can't even get up there. That looks important for later. You're real bad at this, aren't you? Oh. Huh? Need something here. I forget what it is. Oh! You climb up this part of the building. I see. Ah, shit. <laughs> Literally. I had to dodge it, huh? Oh god. Two number two. And of course they had to collide in a messy way. No! Not up there. Donkey Kong, more like Dungy Kong, am I right? The poo. Ah, here we go. Just follow the arrow. Yeah, that's how Prune Juice looks, right? Now, logic would denote that something that drinks that is gonna get the screaming squit. Hmm. Ah, that looks distinctly like a target. And there we have a ball. Yes. I think I get it. I can slowly put two and two together. I may be a squirrel, but I'm not a complete idiot. I just have a drinking problem, that's all. Hey, you. Just hip check the uh the switch. Now that could be useful. Right. This looks like it needs a little bit more hands-on control. He's a bit of a wow one. Mm -hmm. That time again, is it? Oh, I say bugger up to that here again. Oh well. Oh, this nice little patch of a little bit of grass. Moo. Need to get her over there somehow. Hmm. How convenient. Well, he's easy to dodge regardless. You. Come over here. Come get me. I guess that was not the way to do it. Okay, I guess I have to hit the cow personally with the bull. It didn't count! It wasn't dead on. Okay, I see what I gotta do. Stop your nonsense, young man. Goodness me, I've quite lost my appetite now. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go for a little meander over here. Hmm, actually, I feel a bit thirsty. Nice little beverage should wash this tasty grass down lovely like. This looks quite nice. Looks to be cranberry flavoured. Lovely. Hmm, tastes a bit hot. 
ちゃんのは、うんうん Of course, there'll be a cow named Olive. No, Olive Wagyu. Uh oh, this is gonna be facing the wrong way! And that's how you bust up your shoulder. Cool. Gotta try it again. So I gotta make sure I hit her with the bull. It's kind of hard to do, especially with like he's all over the place. Okay, this could be perfect. Gore. It had to be gore, huh? Another cow. Ooh, he tried. Come on, go again. You might get me this time. I gotta hit the cows more times now. Yeah, this one you gotta hit twice. Now do you want the fr prune of the juice? That's going, you gotta stay on the bowl. Otherwise, you gotta try to lure it again. Oh gosh, she's pooing already. Are you Mavis? Ow. Well, that did no damage at least. I don't know if the bull gets any faster now we're on phase three. But the strategy seems to work all the same. That must be all of. <laughs> Good thing I can hear the footsteps. Oh, oh. Is that gonna miss? Oh, that just barely missed. Great. I how much harder this would be if Chocolate did not respawn. Too bad he can't just stand right next to the cow and that counts as hitting it. I feel like that should have been a viable strategy too. Woo! <laughs> 
Oh my god, I'm gonna miss again, aren't I? No, I managed to turn it. Well, that's really close. <laughs> Didn't have any formal momentum to count as a hit anyway. You don't even need to drink that much, and already she's shitting. Whoa. Down to oh, can I get to the money now? B come for that. I'm on the water. Hold down, B, to make me swim. Point the control stick in the direction you want to go. That's it. Um, are you sure you got that? Oh, okay, now I gotta find where the hell the money was. So I heard it around here. <laughs> Oh, I think that's where I was before. I think I know where to look. But I gotta go pretty deep. Wait, was that the bull there? Somebody get me! So... I'm still dripping in it. Yeah, more fun to it. Alright. Now I gotta rem remember how the hell I get out. Guess just drop down the hole, same as before? Yes. Oh, the dung beetle's gone. Okay, I think this would be a good time to stop here. So in the next episode, I'm rolling a big turd ball. Yeah, that's how the next episode's gonna go. See you later.